everyone, this is Talster and I'm here in Huntington Beach, Fountain Valley kind of and I recently came upon this abandoned Boston Market which was I think one of the last Boston markets here in California. Um, I'm gonna film as much as I can real quick because I have to catch my bus real soon. But I think this Boston Market's like really small enough to look. Yeah, so um, a couple weeks ago I had a coupon for Boston Market and I wasn't the only one so I decided to come and when I came they said that they weren't going to be open for 12 o'clock and then I, I waited at the Stater Brothers and then I came back and then they like scratched it off and said oh we're, we'll be back at 1 and I'm like okay what the heck and it just took so long like it was nearly impossible but as you can tell, you can see that there used to be a Boston Market logo right here. But now it's completely gone. I, don't know, I guess maybe because of like poor customer service, they had to close down the... I think that they could have at least tried a bit harder with their customer service because like they said they would come in, they would be open at 12. Then they, they like had a marker and crossed it off and they said, oh, we'll be back at 1. And then they were like, oh, no, just wait a couple minutes. And I'm like, what? That's like really bad customer service, but it has recently another closed. another one in, um, I was gonna say Brookhurst, but it, I don't think it's Brookhurst. Is it Brookhurst? No, it's not Brookhurst. It's Adams Avenue and um, Harbor in, Hunt in Costa Mesa. That one also closed. When I first tried their food, it wasn't as good as I thought. I mean, the macaroni was okay. The chicken was a little dry, but I don't know, I think maybe their customer service was really poor. Maybe that's why they closed. And I wasn't the only one that kind of said something. There were some other people like, oh, no wonder why they're closing all their restaurants. Yeah, according to this paper, they got evicted. I'm guessing maybe they, they just stopped caring about their customers and stuff and the restaurant. Which is kind of sad, you know. I really don't like it when people like don't really care much about their restaurants because some people we really like certain restaurants and we want them to run forever and we love the food and coming in but when you're working and you're just in it for the money it's like not really that good like it, you could definitely tell that that people who care more about the money do a really poor job yeah this one's really small I'm surprised they haven't covered it, which is why I wanted to record it real quick before, in case they were to cover it. I know there's some homeless people around. But that's pretty much it. Anyway, that's all I'm gonna film for today. But thank you guys for watching, and comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. This is honestly unexpected, but um, I'll probably do more abandonings in November, most likely, as October, Halloween's coming. But thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.